So here's Too Hot. Say hi, Too Hot. All right, why don't you explain on what we got going on here? Wow. So where, wait, first, this is a semi he just picked up. A guy, uh, a local guy just passed away at a tree service, and uh, so Scotty picked this up. And uh, yeah, so I don't know what his plan is with it. What is your plan with this? It's gonna haul hay, but we got the, this box, which houses the pump and the hitch in the back. It needs to come off because the semi trailer is gonna fit on here, which is in the way. All right, are you ready to move it? Yeah. So it doesn't look like we have the safest hookup here, but sometimes on the farm, you just got to do what you got to do. <laughs> hey, it looks like you got something hooked up there still. Oh, it's, it's under a little pressure there. Gotcha. I'm sure there's gonna be about there's gonna be some comments on there about how safe that was, but I don't think people are gonna like our channel that are worried about stuff like that. <laughs> well, it's on the ground. Are you gonna sell this? What? Are you gonna actually no. sell this? Well, I'll probably just keep it. For, uh, the idea is is to move it forward on there so that the uh, the trailers will clear. Oh, so you're gonna put it back I on? I'd like to because, of, okay. like I said, it houses that pump that runs the hitch in the back, which I don't. That's for moving house trailers, but you know, I doubt we're gonna be moving it. All right, I gotcha. All right, we we got the box off there, so now we're uh, we're gonna take the old Kenworth cab over here for a quick little cruise, see how she's how she's riding. So this thing sat in a field down the road from where I live for man, two out. How long do you think this thing was sitting for? Fifteen years at least. Fifteen years. I would. I, that is no exaggeration. Quite the climb up. Hooey. Diesel, baby. Huh. Big power. Radio works. Oh, yeah. oh, it does. It's got a sleeper too. I don't know how much many nights I'd be spending in there. I don't know. I think I would stay in there. Remember, we're family friendly. Oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> That's what editing's for. Well, you know, it's pretty cool. You got, there's some of these things that, like where Andy was hauling, uh, hauling house trailers from Indiana and stuff. Really? Yeah, pretty cool. It's cool. What do you oh, think? It's a 1988. An 88? Yep. Kenworth. You know, for how long this sat, the interior, it's dirty, but it's... Dude, it's, it's in good it, shape. It sat for whatever we figured. I think 15 years is a pretty fair mm -hmm. guesstimate. Oh, oh, horn works. But what do you think happened here? A rock. It's a rock. rock. From what? Horn. Him mowing the lawn. Oh, really? Yep. Well, I mean, I know it wasn't a gunshot. It's no. like way too big. I gotta get it fixed. You can see where one hit here too. Yeah. a video on how to shift a truck like this or how not to uh, yeah, yeah well maybe we'll let you take a few laps in her before then doing doing burnouts in a semi CDL? Yeah. 
first ride in the old Kenworth. I honestly, I cannot believe how this thing is running, running so smooth. And uh, the inside, while I, like I said, it is dirty, but it's in really good shape. I mean, I, I, I this, so I've driven past this truck every day for years. I thought it was just destined for the junkyard when uh, the guy that owned it died, his name was Andy. When Andy died, I thought we were going right to the junkyard with it, but old Too Hot resurrected it, brought it back from the dead, and now it's going to have a use again. We living on his uh, Carp Lake Farms as a hay hauler. This is actually nice because we're getting like a full circle thing, like at the hay hauler, we're going to do a video about how you cut the hay, and someone talk about some of the equipment, talk about the cows. to do it. Just grind them. Just grind them and make <laughs> it to make it till you make it. You got most of your cows out at the other place. We'll yep. visit there too. So two uh, keeps his farm or his cows at two places because he's got too many for uh, the pasture he owns. So he leases a farm uh, down the road. Ride smooth for I mean you know you like you didn't change the tires did you? Two brand new. Two brand new. Uh, what that cost? Uh, not brand new. I'm sorry. Uh, used used new were, to you? Yeah, they were fifty bucks. I bought two. Oh well, that's not that's not what I expected. No, they're about five hundred new. If I am feeling a little bit of a weird chugging or something.
Okay. Still a learning process. I'm recording again. Ah! <laughs> yeah. Can't be afraid to fail, you know. Are you gonna leave it up here, or are you gonna no. go down the hill? Uh, you know, all the same house. No, this is moved in years. So. Right. That's sticky. Some of the hay equipment we were talking about. Man, you got equipment everywhere. Like, do you need the both balers? No, that one's actually going to be going right down. Like, we bought another red one just like that. Oh, there's another one right there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, getting close to the. Well, I guess you're not. This thing doesn't have a nose. Alright, so that was the maiden voyage on the old Kenworth. So, we're going to go down and head, uh, check out some of the uh, other cows that Two Hot's got, another part of his farm. So we'll see you there shortly. What's that? They love crashing my fence. <laughs> if it's not 3,000 volts, they will crash right now. This is Timmy's idea of fixing. Northbound Nation. This is the end of the video. Thanks for sticking around till the end. Uh, hit that like and subscribe button so you can see all the new future content. There'll be a lot more videos with Too Hot and a lot of other characters. So we're really looking forward to bringing those to you. Um, like I said, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Mm -hmm.